I do it? I did it! Victory is mine! My triumph was fleeting. The platform collapsed after the ballistic abuse from all the missiles. Level up. Room. Uh, I'll go with gag reflex. I just sit here and heal. If I took a few tries. Now onward. And now Fox, did you just sink one of my submarines? She attacked first. Ah, then it was you. Thank you for revealing your position. Hey Fox, are you there? Here I Oops. am. <laughs> Fox, the comms are fucking lit. They're sending everything they have to the docks. What the hell did you do? I just sank a nuclear submarine. That'll teach it not to launch its missiles at me. Are you kidding me? I'm serious. Good thing it wasn't armed with nuclear warheads. They must be saving them for Operation Jericho. Speaking of nukes, hearing a lot of chatter that they're prepping there to the Omega building. Man, if you don't stop them, there's going to be a worldwide bloodbath. I won't be stopping them. But who else will? I don't care, Robert. Right now, I don't need to be recruited by another colonel to save the world. Right now, I just need to save my ass. And the moment I find anything, even a pull float, I'm getting the hell out of here. Come to me. Ah! No! No! How dare you! Ooh, gasoline, give to me. Hey, a coin. Damn it. Hey, a coin. Yes, come. Gotcha! No? Gotcha! First things first, let's see what we've got here. Ooh, first aid kit, very nice. Not a... Ooh, for another first aid kit. Zilch. Another first aid kit. Inside that hangar, I found what I was looking for. Boats I needed to escape. There was a Zodiac motorboat and a hovercraft. The Zodiac was the faster and more maneuverable choice in the water. But hovercrafts were versatile and could pass over terrain where Zodiacs could Oh, move. great. Uh, hmm. Quick save real fast. Worf. And, uh, we'll try the hovercraft. As I checked the hovercraft, I found out that... Its gas tank was empty. Fortunately, I have gasoline. Ah, crap. Black Thunder.
Inside that hangar, I found as I checked the Zodiac, I found out that its gas tank was empty. Try the Zodiac. Machine gun. Very good. Down you go. Boss defeated. Victory is mine. That stinky hovercraft. A thousand eyes are watching you. With that chopper exhausted every drop of gas I had left. With no gas, the engine stopped shortly thereafter. Despite the dangers, I used my own arms to paddle forward. Piranhas and crocodiles constantly tried to eat my hands. But I was lucky enough to make it to a small dog. Oh good, we don't have to play that part. Certainly a lucky man, Mr. Fox. Oh, give me all of them. All the reeds. Don't know what I'll use them for, but I want them. Please, oh please, don't kill me. Why would I want to kill you? Hold on, you're not one of those bastards. Of course not, I'm a very nice guy. By the way, what are you doing? Those bastards won't stop Building fences everywhere. They think the jungle is theirs, so I cut them to fuck with them. <laughs> ah! Do you have, by any chance, a van to get out of here? I had one, but they took it away. The old man told me a few stories about that place. It was isolated, with no roads or towns nearby. And most importantly, he told me about what I might encounter up ahead. Over here, anything? Hello? No secrets. There, hidden in the middle of the jungle. Ah, uh, those are the thousand eyes. The level of security was sky high, like the mansion of a cartel boss, and I could see why. Because the center of this fortress was the Omega building, the heart of Operation Jericho. The old man told me that he saw some helicopters landing on top of the building. If I stole one of them, that would be my ticket out of there. One thing was for sure. If I was detected by a camera and the alarm triggered, they would put the Omega building in lockdown and I could kiss those helicopters goodbye. But none of that matters because, even though I was already showing signs of exhaustion, I slid in like a shadow and managed to go undetected. The door was locked and chained. There was nobody outside, so finding the key for the lock wasn't an option. I could cut the chain with a bolt cutter, but where would I find one? My, the old man has one, of course. Hello, friend. Give me that bolt cutter. But it's it's mine. <laughs> oh my God! Now it's mine. Jesse, you bastard! Seven foot long reed. Wait, wait, wait! Are you saying that you stole from some defenseless old man? 
You're a special sort of monster. Thank you. Me? No, 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 no. I paid him. When I said it was practically highway robbery, I meant. Hello, friend. Hello, Gramps. I want to buy that bolt cutter. Don't you dare. It's mine. How much are you willing to pay? Here are some coins. It's little money, pal. Oh, look. I also have 10 million. No, not the 10 million. Thank you, Gramps. You're welcome, kid. Ooh, water closet. Don't mind if I do. Ah, that's good stuff. No, nothing. On the east side, the cameras were accompanied by guards. I needed to pass without being spotted by Mike or the camera. So, I had to get rid of Mike and leave no witnesses, but it was more complicated than that. Was it? If the camera saw Mike knocked out, lying on the ground, the alarm would be triggered. Seems you just had to move him away from the view of the camera. Exactly, but if Mike wasn't there as the camera viewed his post, the alarm would still be triggered. Whatever I did, the camera had to see Mike standing at his post. Hmm, quite the scenario. Unless it's an episode of MacGyver, it would be impossible to proceed. Hold on. If you're telling me this, that means you made it through, correct? Well, yes, I managed to fool the camera eventually. How did you manage that? If the camera needed to see Mike, I could just make a copy of him. A clone? Yes. The copy was so perfect, Mike's mother wouldn't know the difference. I made the swap when the camera wasn't looking. What? I'm gonna take another piss. String. Jesse here. Over. Hmm. More stream. Okay. Can't get anything from the tree. For it, shit. Didn't you say that the alarm never sounded? You're contradicting yourself, Sergeant. Execute this the liar. Yes, sir. <laughs>
Didn't you say that the alarm never sounded? Hmm. Save again. How do I do this? Truly am at a loss. Didn't you say that the alarm never sounded? Okay, I've got an idea. Let's see if I can't uh, strip the clothes off him. Move a guy while we put him to sleep. Okay, I get that. What am I supposed to do? Didn't you say that the alarm never Okay, nothing Didn't there. The alarm never sounded. Don't have electromagnetic grenades. Thanks, game. Super confused. What? Didn't you say that the alarm never sounded? Didn't you say that the alarm never... Okay, I'm gonna have to pause the game and look this up, because this is making absolutely no sense to me. Back in a minute. Okay. Apparently, what I'm supposed to have done... ...is go through here. for it. Wait. 
Wait, what do I do here? Oh, duh, I just walked directly underneath them. Bullets. A uniform. Game saved. Oh, careful. Don't want to get caught. Wheel of morality, turn, turn, turn. Tell us the lesson that we should learn. All righty. Save again. Perfect. Come on. Come on, come on, hurry up already. Secrets and secrets. Oh yeah, I'm not... You're not tricking me again. Grabbing my fill this time. One man. Ah, crap. Didn't you say that the alarm never sounded? <sighs> oh, that didn't work. Didn't you say that the alarm never... Yes, turn. Stick figures, buddy. Nope. That's as far as I looked up. Wrong button. Really? Didn't you say that the alarm never sounded? Ah, 
let's try this dance again. Thought so. Grenades. Ooh, heart, give me. Nothing. Nothing. I will, however, take a piss. Uh, pissed in your room. What do you think about that, huh? Huh, Bill? Just keep going. Oh. There it was. Jeez. To the Omega building. Don't startle me like that. that. Would be the last place I'd visit on my tour de escape. Hmm. Whoops. Well, I know it's in there. Alarm never sounded. Six grenades. Okay, I will be seen if I pass through these. Didn't you say that the alarm never Good to know. Crap. What? Didn't you say that the alarm never sounded? Uh. Pizza! No, it's Mike. Who do you think I am? I'm Mike. Open up. Hold on while we check. But wait, you're not Mike. Didn't you say that the alarm never set? <sighs> Ooh. Very nice. The fourth document was the logbook of a mini rescue submarine. It mentioned. Okay, that doesn't help. I read the descriptions that didn't help. Don't you dare start turning in sequence. Now we wait. There can I pee here? Yes, I can. All righty. Actually, 
With that, I'm going to end it here. Because we're out of time for this episode, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.